uh, we've talked a little bit uh, about NIL and the portal and how it's impacting college football. The one thing that everyone's going to want to hear us talk about is that and what what you're actually seeing out there. What go, you know, you see everything on the on Twitter and the news and reports of what like, what do you actually see on the ground of what's really going on behind the scenes with NIL and the portal and tampering and players leaving. Uh, and then after that, we can get into how, what is the solution to actually fix it. Yeah, I don't know what the solution is. <laughs> I, I don't. Someone's gonna get paid a lot of money to come up with that solution. I just, yeah, I mean, we talk. I, I just don't see it going away. Yeah. I mean, everyone's coming up with. I mean, you could talk about solutions right now of conferences. You could talk about yeah. everything. Seems to need a solution right now. Um, yeah, we we just need more rules, right? What am I seeing? I'm seeing everything that you just talked about. Yeah. Players are getting paid a lot of money. Mm-hmm. Um, tampering is going on. Um, and then there's those that are following whatever rules that are there to the best that they can. Yeah. Um, but everything is happening. Yeah. And I don't think the intent was, I, I'm all for, I'm all for players getting paid. I am. I, I, I mm-hmm. think it's great. Right. That with the portal together is a complete disaster, which I think everybody has mm-hmm. said. Um, but there just needs to be rules and there needs to be, I mean, look at the NFL, everybody, you got a salary cap, you can use X amount of money. Um, and there's some parity there that, yeah. that, that league was built, right? You, you, you're the last place team. You get the first round pick. Yeah. So they want to be a competitive yeah. league yeah. and everything is built in the NFL to be a competitive league. Now, usually the team with the quarterback, they end up yeah. in the final four and mm-hmm. the Super Bowl winner usually has a good one. So I get all that, but it is built to kind of keep yeah. it balanced. Right. I just, we're going down a road where there's going to be more imbalance than ever. Mm -hmm. And that's the problem. Yeah. You're getting some teams that can really, really pull away. Yeah. And then you're getting some teams that you've seen over the last few years have had a lot of success and you're going to start to see them fall off. And it's not, not because of lack of coaching and it's not because of a lack of effort, but it's because what others are doing, it's just, you're not on the same playing field. You're not yeah. playing in the same sandbox as some of those other teams. Yeah. And that's the part that that's hard. Yeah. You know what yeah. I mean? Cause yeah. you're, you're playing the same game. You're playing the game with the same ball. The rules are the same on the field, Yeah. but off the field, it's just different. Yeah. You know? And yeah. that's, that's what you hope eventually people are always going to have an advantage. Mm-hmm. I got it. Yeah. I, 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 I totally get it. And I respect that. But if you're going to have some teams with a $12 million salary cap and some teams with a $1 million salary cap, it's hard to play money ball in football. Yeah. Yeah. You got to, that's hard. 